Hey guys, we've just launched our new esports program, McLaren Shadow, and here are my quick tips to get the most out of it. So, with the steering inputs, you want to be very, very smooth always, especially in the in the higher speed corners. You know, you don't want to upset the rear of the car, so you try and be very progressive with your initial steering inputs because it's a game, and you you don't have the acceleration like you have in the real car. You have a lot of your feeling actually through the steering wheel, so. It's important to kind of capture the oversteer, the amount of oversteer you have on the exit and yeah, really try to be progressive on the on the initial throttle pickup. In terms of defending, I think the best key is always not to really look behind you what is happening, but really try to have the quickest pace around the circuit because the quicker you go, the more difficult it is for the others to overtake you. Overtaking, obviously everything is about positioning your car and, and finding the right spot to overtake as well. So a track generally has uh, you know, predefined overtaking zones or, or areas where it's always a bit easier to overtake. And you kind of have to figure that out. Generally that's after a long straight into a big braking zone. Um, that's usually where overtaking is easiest. So you kind of want to prepare your lap, set up the car to, to have the best possible chance there. Um, the most important bit I would say is getting you know, the rotation in the corners and, and nailing the tractions. This is where a lot of the lap time comes from. Um, you know, you can do that a little bit through the setup as well. Um, you can, you know, I think the most important on the computer game is actually getting a lot of front grip in the car. Um, because that enables you to turn the car and position it right on the exit. That's it, hope it was helpful and yeah, join the heat soon.